Welcome to this introduction to our video tutorials on visualising sound. Because sound is difficult to visualise, musicians, studio designers, recording, live and mastering engineers all rely on a wide variety of diagrams and meters to help them visualise and measure it and to operate the features and functions of sound recording, sound processing and sound editing equipment. Some of these diagrams and meters are widely found in the project and home studio, in manuals, software interfaces and hardware displays. Therefore, it is essential that studio owners know how to interpret them. In this series, we are going to look at diagrams that represent audio waveforms, frequency response, EQ, dynamic range, compression, microphone polar patterns and impulse responses and the following types of audio meter VU meters, peak program level meters, phase and correlation meters and loudness meters. Each tutorial in this series covers one aspect of visualising sound building towards an understanding of all the primary diagrams and meters and their uses. You can watch them in any order, but they have been ordered in a playlist so that each video builds on the knowledge of the previous one. The level of knowledge was determined by asking what does the average home or project studio owner need to know to effectively operate their equipment. So if you are an electronics engineer, you might find the theory and knowledge a little too general for your needs. The script for this tutorial can be found at our website projectstudiohandbook.com and finally don't forget to subscribe at our website or Facebook or Twitter channel in order to receive notification of new videos, blog posts and member only extras. Thanks very much for watching. Thank <laughs> you.